I want to try the track myself going into a forest and see how the Mini 4 Pro can follow me and can trace me and hopefully avoid obstacles, trees, bushes. See what's happening here. See if the Mini can handle me. Very oh wow, that was something. Come here. Just walk up here, see what's happening here. Wow, pretty good job actually. Let's try to go a little bit down into the woods here. A little more. Obviously, I'm trying to avoid too, too difficult elements, especially elements with a lot of branches that don't have any leaves on it. Don't want to risk my drone. Right now, I have to make sure I don't risk my life. I'm trying to film, follow me, and not falling if I can. Are you there? <laughs> Turning around, okay. We are doing a good job right now. Go around those trees. My gosh, going backwards. Practical avoidance is working. This is really narrow here. My gosh. Yeah. Make sure it's actually more more dangerous for me to do this then for the Mini 4 Pro. Looks like they did a good job. I did your eyes. <laughs> Don't be safe with me. It's on the side. It's a little bit risky. Perfect. Oh my gosh. I'm impressed. I'm literally impressed. It's getting darker and darker here. And the Mini 4 Pro is still doing a great job. The Mini 4 Pro goes backwards now, but it's really impressive how the Mini 4 Pro here really does an amazing job in tracking me, tracing me through the forest here. The Mini 4 Pro is so fast with trying to avoid the obstacles. Sometimes I have a hard time to just break the camera in order to show you guys what the Mini 4 Pro is doing here. Oops, what's going on? Oh, now the ambient light is too low for the Mini 4 Pro to actually track me. Let me show you how dark it is, or not so dark, let's see. So that's the Mini 4 Pro up here. It's, I don't know, it's pretty dark here. Maybe the camera does a pretty good job in, in adjusting the exposure. But for the Mini 4 Pro, this is too dark. It shows me it's too dark to active track. So far the active tracking was pretty good, but now it shows me it's too low in light. The ambient light is too low. So active tracking has an issue following me. Maybe it doesn't help that I have an uh, ND16 filter on it, which I obviously don't need here, because it's actually dark. So actually I should remove it, <laughs> because it causes another little issue here, not enough light. Let's change it out. Next. We test the Mini 4 Pro's resilience. Can it fly post crash? Hit the like button, subscribe, and watch this video next to learn more about the DJI Mini 4 Pro. Bye for now.